Hello everyone, and welcome back to the Vincent's Yard. In this episode, we're working on this vintage piece of furniture. So this is a Singer model RFJ8-8. It would have been new in the early to mid 60s. This one seems to have been well used. It's pretty dirty and fairly discolored. Uh, the cabinet itself has a, quite a few scuffs on it and the cable seems to have been repaired at some point. There we go, that's the cabinet completely broke down to its parts. Now let's get ready for some sanding. All the pieces of wood have been sanded down to 80 grit. Uh, I removed, well these pieces, I removed all the old veneer and I just sanded down the internal hardwood because I find it's quite nice with the lighter inside and the dark outer wood. Thank you. 
This is how far I got with the table today. Everything from the bottom is reassembled and all the panels are glued. So I'll let those dry overnight and tomorrow I'll flip the table over and reinstall that piece of the top. I'll also have to finish sanding the bench which only had its first pass of sanding. So do the second pass, glue, reassemble. And I should also have the chance to start cleaning up the sewing machine itself. So that's where we're at. See you tomorrow. Okay. As I feared was possible, since we removed the veneer off the table surface, the hinges now pop up way too much. So I'm going to have to space them down from the back. And same thing for these ones here. I'll have to cut this groove a bit deeper so the table can be perfectly flush. Okay, day three of the sewing machine project here. 
I let my stain dry overnight. So now it's pretty much 24 hours later and I can start the varnishing process. While I'm waiting for my varnish to dry, I'll start cleaning up the sewing machine itself here. So I'll start using just a damp cloth and then I'll move on to rubbing alcohol and probably an old toothbrush to bring it as nice as possible, but I don't want to damage the writing or the paint itself. After almost two hours of cleanup, this is the result. A nice and shiny sewing machine and a pile of dirty paper towels.
present the final result. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, feel free to leave us a like or a comment. And as usual, I thank you so much for watching.